Okay, so here's something that I really wanted to talk about. Um, I'm 16 years old, and I'm gay. Um, something that I've been seeing a lot of lately is coming out stories. And I thought that it would be nice to share my own. My coming out story isn't really as epic, if you will, as some of the other ones. Nothing exciting happened. There wasn't a huge click or change um, between my relationships with everyone. But at the same time, it helped me be more at peace with myself because... I wasn't lying to anyone anymore. I wasn't being someone that I wasn't anymore. Not that I was before. It's just... After I came out to people, that clarification just helped bond us better. We were able to touch on different topics, and we were able to bond even further. So, the first person that I came out to was my sister, and I knew my sister would not judge me in any way, shape, or form per my um, orientation, because she's a very open person, she's a very accepting person, and she does have a lot of gay friends, lesbian friends. Um, and all that, and she goes out a lot, she knows a lot of people. And really, I was at, this was a few years ago, actually, I was at a friend's birthday party, and it was the end of the day, it was really late, and we were all really tired. And my mother was talking to my friend's parents, and it was just my sister and I sitting alone in the car, and I said, Whitney, we need to talk, there's something that I really want to tell you. And... I explained to her that I felt much more strongly for men than I did for women, and that I was kind of in a moment of stress. I didn't know what to do. Um, I knew there were people like me, but I wasn't sure the best way to let it be known who I really was. And she really looked at me, and she said, Andrew, no matter who you are, all of us will love you. You should know that. You're my brother, your mother's son, your father's son. You are our family. And that will never change. And it really, really changed things between my sister and I. We... Like I said, we can touch on so many different things now, and any kind of awkward air that was there before just isn't there now. Of course, there are still moments, and we still have disagreements, and we still have little brother-sister brawls, but other than that, it couldn't be better. The next person I came out to was my mother, and this was about a year later. Um, basically we were driving home from the store, and we had gone grocery shopping, and it was kind of the same situation. I said, Mom, I'm gay. And she, she was quiet for a minute, and I was kind of worried, but like my sister, I knew that she would not be extremely judgmental. And she just kind of nodded her head and laughed about it. And she basically said, I know. Apparently, I am fabulous because it's apparent to everyone. <laughs> um, after that, it was more or less I was coming up to my friends, and they basically had the same reaction as my mother. We know. So, all in all, it wasn't very painful, and I'm very, very lucky to have an accepting 
family and an accepting group of friends. Finally, most recently, it was not extremely recent, it was about a year ago, I came out to my father, and he, like my mom, was alright with it. He didn't mind. He said, whatever makes you happy will make us happy. Um, you're my son, and I'll love you no matter what. Of course, he gave me the, oh, I'm disappointed, how is our family name going to be carried on speech, but, hey, I have a sister for that. She doesn't have to take on the man's last name. <laughs> Anyways, I really just wanted to touch base on that because I felt like it would be good to get that out there and to let other people who are in the closet, male or female, whatever your situation, I want to let them know, don't be afraid. People will judge you no matter what. People are always judging you. But you have to love yourself for who you are, and you have to give people the chance to love you back and not be so worried about what they think. I will say this, though. I knew that nothing detrimental would happen when I told my family. If you're unsure or if you have parents or friends who are homophobic, very gay bashing, things like that, or highly religious and don't accept those things. And I'm not saying that religious people do not. It's just there are a lot of close-minded people in the world. If you think you have an inkling or you know something detrimental could happen if you come out to people, I would wait until you're on your own until you are established in the world and you can fall back on yourself without worry. Um, really, more importantly than letting that out of the closet is to make sure that you stay safe while also still being yourself. So. That's really my whole story. Like I said, it's nothing epic. <laughs> nothing exciting happened. Nothing really bad happened. But lots of good happened. So, I just really wanted to share that with all of you. And I will also hopefully be making more videos in the future. Thanks, guys. I'll see you later.